All right, guys. I got us a Sergeant Signature series here. We got a visitor today, Mr. Arda Klein, our average picker. He was nice enough to leave this here with me. Picked it twice so far. I'm gonna try to do it on camera now. all of our pins are set. It feels that way. Now let's work on the sidebars from this weird angle. This thing drops into a very deep pot set after you pick them the first two times. It's actually crazy, you'd think the lock was open, but it's not. You have to pick the one on the right a second time. side, I believe. I think we'll have to use this pick for the left side here. Maybe I can't see crap. Let's go back to our standard here and see what we can do with that. This isn't the one I used before, I can't. No, it can't be, because that feels very weird. side. Hmm. Of course it wants to be a pain now. with the right side one more time just because I, I think that was it now the left side hmm there it goes and there's the deep pot set I was talking about as you can see the lock is not open now 
this right side one more time. Which is a pain from this angle. Not see shot. Okay, I think that's there it is. And as you can see, we are definitely open. I don't want to rotate that a complete 180 because I don't know what it will or will not do. But it is definitely open. Alright. We do not have a key for this dude, so we do not want to lock him back up. But yeah, as you can see, definitely ticked. Alright. Let's see here. Rotate this boss out of the damn way. I'm gonna end up messing with this lock a lot more though off camera after this video because that is a very fun little lock. I ain't gonna tighten it up too much, just enough to get it out of the damn way here. Alright, let's see. Where is my screwdriver now? Uh -huh. Screwdriver. Definitely got to be careful when gutting this thing because it has got the two sidebars in it. And from what I've been told, those springs are not hard at all to lose, but very hard to find. <laughs> Hold on, where's my damn ladder at? Alright, let's see. Where is inning tray and follower maybe yeah buddy oh, there they are I do not want that the sidebar is coming out of this thing by any means whatsoever We have got them both. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to try to get these out of here first. Shoo. Oh, I dropped the pin too. Or so it sounded like. I'm not too worried about the key pins. I do not want to lose these springs to these sidebars more than anything. Alright, good deal. And yeah, we did drop pin six out of there. And there it is. Alright, I see three springs. Let's see here. What do we got? What do we got? Nope, they're all four there. Good deal. Good deal, good deal. Phew. Where in the hell did you go, dude? We'll go ahead and put everything for the sidebars up there in that top tray. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Why is there two pins in chamber one? That's a new one on me. The wafer two? Did that come out of pin chamber one? Very strange. It had to have, though, because nothing else, yeah. I bet that key pin on one's so short that the driver's down in there. It's got to be what that is. Sure nothing else is down on this little dude. Awesome. Let's see what is up here. Yep, that's exactly what it was in one. The key pin so short that the damn driver happened to be down in there as well, I guess. Very strange. I've never messed with 
locks that had been master keyed though, so I don't know exactly how that does or does not work. Oh wow. There's another wafer. Or no, two key pins. That's not strange at all. Or drivers, not key pins, but either way, yeah, very weird. And I forgot to knock the spring out of three whenever. Alright, let's see here. Oh, you little shit. There's a wafer in there, too. Or no, another, I guess that's a wafer. Hell, I don't know what that is. It looks like another driver pin. This thing is set up here. Holy shit. Alrighty, dudes. And everything is there. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Be very careful here. Those tiny ass little springs up there. That I'm going to have to hold in my hand, I guess, because you can't see them. You can kind of see them, but not really. Let me see something here. Maybe if I shine my flashlight on them, you can see them a little bit better. Oh, yeah, there you go. You can see all four of them springs up top now. Two of them are right next to that sidebar, and then two are up in the upper left corner. Good deal. And there is all the pins in that thing. Holy shit, that's crazy. Alrighty, turn the seizure light off there. Alright guys, and there you have it. That's a Sergeant Signature Series that belongs to Average Picker. And this is going to be my submission, or my second submission for Purple Belt on Reddit. The first one was a 7 core, I mean 7 pin best core. Alright, y'all have a good one.